<sighs> I'm actually quite nervous today. <sighs> Just breathe, eh? <laughs> Just breathe, everything will be fine. <laughs> we can do it! Bye! So I know a lot of you guys are going to be wondering, what are we going to get up to after riding around the world? Well, take a look at this. This is a Suzuki GSX-S125. And you can see there's some learner plates put on it. What is that all about? Well, this bike is not for me. This bike is for Lavi, because today she is about to take her CBT, her compulsory basic training. Whee! So, of course, she can't ride this little beast down to the test center. So I'm gonna have to ride it for her. Woohoo! Listen to that. This little beast, hey? Oh, this is a bit strange. This is a bit strange. <laughs> so I literally just picked this up from the kind guys at Suzuki yesterday. They have kindly donated this for Lavi's training. Thank you so much, guys. That is absolutely awesome. I actually really, really like this. You know, it's only a 125, but it's actually quite nippy, to be honest. Quite nippy. So yes, after riding nearly 47,000 miles around the world, it seems that Lavi got tired of being my pillion, so she wants to ride her own bike for our next adventure. So a couple of weeks ago, we applied for a provisional license here in the UK for her, and now today's the day she's gonna take her CBT training. The training center is called Carmen's Bike Training, and we got in touch with those guys through Motorcycle World in Northampton, the amazing dealership that donated us our beloved Bumblebee for our round the world adventure. So those guys have been absolutely awesome. We went in there for like a post-trip meeting and they brought us cake and they brought us lunch and there were confetti cannons we made it happy to love <laughs> it was so so beautiful during the trip so many people were commenting online like that we should get our own license get lavi our own bike we we're on the way this is the first step towards Lavi getting her own bike and being completely mobile on her own. And I'm really excited for her to get this journey started. So it's about 25 minutes over to the training center. They've already gone in the car. I'm actually gonna be late. And I'm just gonna be hanging around with them for the day, doing some filming, being a general nuisance. But it's gonna be a great day. I can't wait. Look at that, 49 miles an hour, 50 miles an hour. This bike might not be as powerful as the great Bumblebee, but honestly, it's not too bad. The only thing that's a bit unnerving for me is that when I look forward, I literally cannot see any bike at all, which is really, really strange for me because I'm used to like sitting behind the windshield and with the big tank bag in front of me. This kind of feels like I'm just flying along in midair. So it is a little bit strange, I must admit. But you know what? It's also a lot of fun. Honestly, I don't know why people don't just give one, two, fives a go. You don't really need more than this, do you? Look at that. <laughs> Whoa, hear that engine roar. <laughs> but you know what is one really cool thing about this bike? I can put one foot down, lean the bike to the side, Oh, it's so lightweight. It is so lightweight. Honestly, it feels like I'm riding a bicycle. I'm used to the fact that if you lean even a slight bit, oh, we're going. If you lean even a slight bit on Bumblebee, that's it, you're falling over, you're done. Oh, it's okay. Okay, cool. <gasps> oh no, oh no, no, no. Ah! <sighs> Oh no! Oh no! No no! Ah! This bike's a bit more forgiving and honestly I think it'd be hard to drop this bike. Look at that, so casual. Uh, honestly I think we should just do our next travel on like this bike times two. <laughs> Wee -hee! Yeah. 64! 65, 66, 67, 6, 68 miles an hour. Oh my goodness. Honestly, that feels a little bit dodgy on such a small bike like this. Oh, it's my exit. Honestly, 68 miles an hour. You don't need more than that. Good job, little GSXS. Good job. 
All right, so the training center should be somewhere in here. Hello. All right, very good. Look at this. <laughs> this is great. It's a little bit smaller, but you know what? 70 miles an hour doesn't go bad. It's pretty good. But the weird thing for me, you can't see the bike really when you're on it. <laughs> so it's like you're just floating down the road. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. This is a powerful beast. Look at this. GSX 650. How are you feeling? <laughs> Colin would teach me everything. <laughs> I'm sure about it. I'm sure about it. <laughs> So that is it, Lavi is inside here and she's already started the training. So I'm not allowed to film inside the training center whilst they're doing it because there are other people learning at the same time. We don't want to make them more nervous than they already are. But they did give me a handy clipboard so that I can explain to you guys the elements of the CBT that they're going to be taking Lavi through. So there's five elements to the CBT training. Elements A, B, C, D and E. Element A is an introductory lecture where they talk about the clothing, they do an eyesight test. Then they come outside for element B where they talk about the motorcycle controls, starting and stopping the engine, what checks you need to do, safety checks on the bike. Element C is when they get to actually start riding the bikes and that's where they'll be in the car park behind me doing maneuvers, figure of eights, U-turns, emergency braking, basically getting a handle on the controls of the bike. Then they'll go back inside for element D, which is the road safety briefing before coming out of this gate and hitting the roads. Apparently, Lavi is gonna be with her own trainer, so I'll be able to follow those guys behind and basically commentate on everything they're doing. But the guys here at Carmen seem super, super nice, so I think Lavi's in safe hands. And that's it. If the road ride goes well, Lavi's gonna be able to ride straight out of here, legal on the roads. How cool is that? So I just went and got Lavi some lunch from Subway. It was a meatless Philly six inch sub. So I'm just gonna stuff that under my jacket. Oh, Cause she's training hard, she needs her energy. Oh, and this is the bike that I'm riding. I haven't shown you guys this yet. So this is my dad's Suzuki GSX 650. Look at that beast. And I've actually never ridden it before until today. And I tell you what, it is very, very different from the, from the V-Strom. Yeah. Yeah, because I couldn't start it when I left the test center to go to get lunch. But the guy from the test center was like, oh, has it got an immobilizer on it? I was like, I don't know. Turns out there was. Whoa, that turning is weird really strange so the guys are inside for their final road safety briefing and then it's time to get out on the road plus the sun's come out for us it's turned into an absolutely beautiful day so i think that's a sign it's going to be a great ride See you guys. All right guys, that is it. The moment everyone's been waiting for. Lavi is out on the public roads of England. <laughs> so I can't hear their intercom, but Rich, the trainer at the front there, he's talking to Lavi, telling her what's going on, telling her where to go. I'm just coming along for the ride. This is a totally surreal experience. I can't believe that this is Lavi riding her own bike on the roads of England. Ah, oh, amazing. Should be out for about two hours this afternoon. And if all goes well with that, then at the end, Lavi is gonna be a legal road rider. Doesn't she look cute riding that bike? <laughs>
He's looking really good already. I can see plenty of head turns. Yeah, there's one there. Life savers, as they call them. It's all about just looking around you, seeing where everything is, making sure that you're safe at all times. When you change road position, when you make turns, always just doing those life savers, putting your head over to the left, head over to the right. Yeah, nice. It's making me paranoid now because they keep doing everything really correctly. And I'm like, oh my God, am I doing it correctly? I mean, I passed my motorcycle test when I was 17 years old. Oh, they're stopping. Oh, I think this bit is a hill start bit. See if she can start going uphill. Here we go. Lifesavers. Yeah. Gonna pull off. Oh, stalled it. Here we go. Yes, yes, pulling off. Nice. Amazing. Good job, Lavi, good job. <sighs> That's a yes from me. <laughs> How is it? It was good. It's good so far. It's time for Lavi's turn in the road. Here we go, safety checks. Checking around. Here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. She's gonna do it. She's gonna do it. Oh, she's turning. Oh, she's turning. Oh, just about. Try number two. Here we go. She's gonna make it round. Is she gonna make it round? Yes. Nice. Okay, last one. Here we go. U turn number three. Here we go, ready, ready, ready. Is she gonna go? Is she gonna go? Nice. Nice. Amazing. <laughs> Easy going, eh? You're a pro. From this point onwards, what I'm now going to do is put you in front of me. Okay. You're still going to get all the instruction you've been getting up to this point. Oh my god. But it just means that you're not copying me, basically, yeah. Can you go ahead? Yeah. <laughs> so we're following Lavi the leader. it is time for Lavi's emergency braking part of the day. She's already practiced this in the car park during the earlier element of the day. Now it's time for her to try it out in the wild. Oh, well, she seems to be stopped. How was it? Absolutely nailed it. Nailed it, hey? Nice. It's a little bit nerve wracking, but uh, it's so much fun. <laughs> yes! Spawn! Good job. Perfect. Amazing. Perfect. We're gonna do a little bit more riding around. Okay. okay. I follow you now. 
Oh, you'll still out in front. Oh. <laughs> so Lavi's done her turn in the roads successfully. She's done her emergency stop successfully. Now it's time for some open road and some national speed limit. It's time to open up the throttles. <laughs> go coming up to 50 miles an hour nice 51 52 53 54 miles an hour yeah now we're getting some speed I think we hit 55 there nice all right it's time for our last challenge of the day and that is the dual carriageway in front of us, the A45. Speed limit, 70 miles an hour. The last box to be ticked of the CBT. It's time to get some speed, let's do it. carriageway done and Lavi has passed all the tests with flying colors she has done absolutely amazing and what a cool day this has been nice awesome Yes? She's good? She's good! Yes! Thank you so much! So we can cruise around together, hey? Right. <laughs> when you first got on the bike this morning, that first time pulling away, going up and down, teetering around in your first gear changes. Oh my god! So that then coming yes. down the A45, uh, yes. you get about 66 miles an hour coming down yes. the A45. We got some speed up at the end. Right, so well done. That's valid so for two much. years. You can ride motorcycles up to 125cc and Enjoy. we look forward to seeing you. Yes. Be your full license. You guys are amazing, Enjoy. really good. No problem at all, mate. I look forward to seeing you. Amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Glad you're doing it. Really, really, really amazing. She rides, she rides really well. <laughs> yeah. I paid him to You're a superstar. <laughs> yes! Woo! All right, are you ready to ride home? Nice! But you go slow. I will go slow, don't worry. I will go slow. Let's do it. Thank you so much, Rich. See you later. Stand down. Lavi and Ollie first ride together on two bikes. Yes! yes. <laughs> Amazing. It was so nice. It was so good, hey? Yes. She did it! She passed. It was all good. Well done, well done. I knew you would. My hand from using the clutch. Yeah. It's like, you know? This Got some new muscles coming, hey? Yeah, here, here, this one. That was a super exciting day and I'm super, super happy <laughs> that I got my CBT now. So... You have your CBT. We can practice, we can go around England a little bit, hey? <laughs> yeah, and get ready for the next adventure. Exactly. And that's it from us today. We hope you enjoyed the video. If so, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, share the video with your friends and family, comment below, and we will see you next time.